Carnatic music is we had to do the Carnatic music is it's it's it came from basically from the you know the Tamil tradition base. There are different um, divisions there. And the, uh, in Carnatic music, we are giving the compare voice. So Carnatic music, we have some more improvising music part in Carnatic music. In Panise, is a improvise not only that much of improvising is certain variation. So it's called Sangati in um, Tamil. Uh, it's the term of the Tamilese. Variations will be there and the it's the calculation in columns as well. It's little patterns will be on the panese. <laughs> Carnatic concerts and Carnatic format, it it will be rather than the bit different uh, from the Panise, you know, because the Carnatic music is very deep improvising there. Mm -hmm. uh, it's called improvising. It's called we are using the term this manodharmam. Manodharmam it's split into two things. So one is kalpita music. Kalpita means already fixed, so already notation format. No, whatever example, uh, Varnam, you, you know that Varnam. And another one is Katpane. Katpane means improvising. Katpane terms mean Tamil, Tamil term. That means improvising music. So once if you learn this Kalpitam only, you can, you, you will get capable, capable to, you, you're able to do the improvising. So improvising is the main part in Carnatic music. One, if you do the, if you want to do more and more and more involved in the improvising, you should know the Kalpitam properly. Then only that is the foundation for this improvising. That is a fact on this Gandhi. Mm -hmm. And Panizai, if you know the basic pitch knowledge, that's called Shruti and Talam knowledge. One, if you learn, example, once if you go to Oduar in Louis Chen Temple, so when he teach the raga phrases and the ascending and descending order, and if you know the phrases of the Sarastanam and all the stuff, then when they teach, then you can easily repeat it. have been historically really important in in building up music yeah. but i wonder yeah. now if you're thinking about um carnatic music in panisai in london how is how important is, is in lucium particularly you're asking lucium huh? yeah in lucium yeah yeah lucium is a, it's a very very good environmental uh, in lucium because there's lots of our community people and more other people are um, able to come to there's a good location is, is beyond that one uh, uh, and uh, you know the very popular musicians are living in around that area as well and most of the teachers are because they are conducting the lots of events every weekend and uh, there's a more popular place uh, I think in London so uh, that's a, and I, I like the, the Lucian Sivan also. He's a very powerful goal. So once you go, you can, when you worship, you will get everything. That is a human thought. Um, and the very historical and traditional occasion and a very good place in uh, Lucian is very, very good for location in London. Mm -hmm. And I guess that's there that. are there have been a lot of Carnatic, in, you know, aside from, um, you know, the pujas, as, as you were saying, um, Odova singing for pujas and um, the performances between pujas during things like Shiva Ratri, there's also the Temple Hall, where there have been many, many Carnatic concerts, people coming from 
from India and from Sri Lanka. Everywhere. Women. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, Every, mm -hmm. everywhere they're conducting the lots, lots, lots of concerts uh, during the weekends. Mm -hmm. uh, that's a good occasion. Yeah. yeah. And how is it? How is it to be a Carnatic musician in London? Performing wise, you know, the, we have uh, uh, lots of Sarangapans we are participating and some of the, uh, you know, Carnatic concerts, proper concerts and the students showcases and we are doing uh, apart from that one so everything going well at the moment so carnatic music uh, growing up in london is absolutely brilliant and absolutely fine there's so much to learn with carnatic music and it's an oral tradition to oral tradition isn't it so yeah, everything... exactly we also so every every stage is a good lesson for us so we are we are getting different experience in every stages you know so every performance will get one lesson for us. This is a very big story of our artist. The Carnatic music, there's a big story. Once if you learn that basic, then only you know the improvising knowledge. So improvising, you have to show on your stage when you perform. That is a, that is a talent thing. So you have to show your talent. If you want to show your talent, you have to improvise it lots. That's only the big difference. That's a fact in between the and say in Carnatic mm, music. Mm. There's a, once if you want to increase your creativity, you had to practice these basic lessons in different ragas, different sarasanas. And um, um, there are five divisions in creativity in Carnatic music, I would like to say. Mm. So it's called Ragam, Tarnam, Pallavi, Niraval, and Kapanasuram. So Raga, raga, raga Alap, you know the Raga Alapana. So, um, improvising the phrases, rather special phrases, you had to uh, make it, it's like a build a house. So you had to make a, you know, the foundation, then you had to create a same as build the house. <laughs> This creativity, these five different creative kind of paths within, within Carnatic music, or yeah, Carnatic music. They're quite. Yeah. Um, they're also quite bound by particular rules, right? On the stage, that depends on the timing wise. You know, the timing wise, you can't do this. So, in proper concerts, it, the, the, that's called the main item is Ragan Tanam Pallavi. They're saying this short in form. So it has to be five variations, has to be together. So it will be that one slot, it will be for one hour time. Mm -hmm. So it will depend on the mood. And can I just ask, I mean, where does Bhavam come into this as well? Because Bhavam is like a musical expression of the, of the Raga. Is that right? Bhavam. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, Bhavam is the musical expression on the um, Swarasthanam. Swarasthanam, if uh, you know the different different rahas has different different rahas has different expression, so, and different uh, ragas it will make different mood uh, on the, you know the in Pupalam, Bauli, it will it is able to sing on the morning time, and any uh, if you feel sad, if you say. Subhapandavarali is the sad mood. And uh, if you want the sleepy mood is Nilampari. Is, that kind of example I can say. I, I hope you know that. Mm -hmm. uh, this kind of, you know, the every raga has different expressions. So, mm -hmm. it depends. And how, how do, you, do you, I mean, is that something that you think about when you are improvising, when you're being creative? Do you think about the bhavam of the raga? Yes. Of course, of course, it has to be when you do the creativity and it will come automatically because once if you get involved with the ragam, once if you get experience, then it will come itself. Mm. It will come itself because bhavam is a very, very, very main thing rather than the pitch and talam. Bhavam, it will come later. So 
in 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 the basic you will get pitch perfection and thalam then you had to learn the compositions properly then when you get an experience it will come the power mm -hmm. it will come itself but we can't, we can't teach that experience. we can't teach the bhavam to children but it will come itself and it has it will come themselves as well so i wondered if i could ask a little bit about the goldsmiths collaboration back in 2016 um and the songs of the saints um project where we um worked with um uh, manipala from k sarangan and um, Pete, Rupa Karan. Rupa Karan and um, Francis Silkstone Francis. and some, some of the students from Goldsmiths as well. As an unforgettable uh, uh, occasion at that time, so beautiful, beautiful time we had it. And the performance also, it, it went very well. Um, and we had a different experience uh, um, when we work with uh, other instruments, you know, Western instrument. We had an a coordination between the Sarangan and Krupa uh, before, uh, but this this is a different way of thinking, and the, this is a very good creativity, I can say, in this occasion. The the improvisation in Mohanam. Yeah. So Mohanam is a raga that is very popular. Yes. It's performed a lot. It's performed in Carnatic concerts. It's it's sung as part of the. The Panisai in the temple. Yeah. Um, and I just wondered, um, how was it in that situation at the performance um, to to improvise in Mohanam compared to when you normally improvise in Mohanam? Um, uh, it's a different, um, rather than the as usual uh, that occasion and the location as well, um, and the different or different type of audience was there as well. Um, and uh, um, the, we we work with the different artists also. Um, you know, the, when we start, I I started to play the Mohan. I hope oh Sarangan started, then I joined, then uh, Pete joined, then uh, um, Lynn joined, then everyone's together. That is a different idea. That's absolutely fine, absolutely brilliant idea. And it, it did feel like you know because um, Francis was kind of quite loosely conducting you know bringing people in and exactly sort of thing. Yeah. so i guess your musical role kind of changed as well a bit because i i mean correct me if i'm wrong but as a violinist if you're playing with the vocalist then you're kind of enhancing what they're yeah. they're half the way through you had to join with them so then it's like a it's like it, it was like a fusion this is an improvising fusion you know change the way that you were kind of expressing the raga in that situation or was it was yes, it we did. on the on the goldsmith project you're asking yeah. about yeah 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 we, we because uh, the depends on the um you know the france is set so you had to start uh, sarangan start then ratish follow then uh, pete joined then lynn joined then katrina play uh, then we, they did some Taniyavatnam in Mirdanga because, the, you know, that depends on the time occasion. So that is our bhavam, it will come. So, so now if, if, you know what I'm saying, if they're going to play the proper, you know, the proper Carnatic concert, if they, if they choose, if, if they choose as the Mohanam is the main, main kriti, main composition on the Carnatic base, so I'm going to improvise for half an hour Raga Alapana. So it will come more bowers, you know. That is what I said. It depends on the time. 
because that is some time sense because everything did come on the time sense mm -hmm. so we need they they expected only the short raga then i will i will i will give my best on the short raga if we are going to play 30 minutes raga i can do more mm -hmm. if they expect one hour raga i can do more so it depends not only me so everyone is the same situation there on that on the time we had it okay. and we did the bar one expression and the uh, everything as well well done so it's, so it's really dependent on time then and what what you can express and how you can express yeah. it and what sort of imaginative and inventive ideas you can come up with in that time period yeah seconds yes do you do you think it is important to do that kind of project yes it has to be in future as well because uh, the um, because uh, when the students uh, example pete katrina lin they are the, they were the students on that time so i hope they had an experience when we work with us as well mm. so we had an experience with work with them so end of the day once if you learn new thing that is good for your improvement yeah great mm.